Today, we're looking at a brand new smart cottage that's offered by Oak Creek Homes. And uh, this one is super cool. It's got a back that's not covered. That was the main reason why I wanted to tour this one for it. Y'all stay tuned for to check that out. I wanna tell you where I'm at. This is Oak Creek Homes in Splendor, Texas, right here. Going north of Houston. I know the traffic's crazy. We're right here on a major highway, but I wanted to give you a shot. I know we'll get some drone shots, so yeah, let's go ahead. What is so cool about this one is this is a tiny house that, you know, I know there's a lot of people that love to look at these homes. And so I was like, well, I want to do one of them, one of them for you guys. And I chose to do this one because we have a side, no, we do have a side door, but that's not the reason. It was this right here. And now that we've kind of got a look at it from here, now, now let me say this is a show model, you kind of order off of it, and that way you could skirt the whole thing like the front is and everything. But we've seen this view, let me show you what it's like up there. Whoa. Yes, sir. This is nice. I mean, could you imagine a little evening out here on the grill? That's what I'm talking about. Man, fellas, I'm just saying if, you know, if, if you're a single fella out there and you're looking for a pad, one bed, one bath with this, um, mm, or ladies, I mean, you know, this is so awesome. All right, we got to get on with the tour. Let's head on back down there. Now that we got our feet planted back on God's green earth, let's take a look just right around here. Give you a close up there. Is there. Anything that we need to see? Just give you one quick shot. Okay, let's go ahead. And now, let me say if you really enjoyed these types of homes, check out our tiny house playlist. Comes with your swing here, and this porch is good size. Both porches are nice, right? Nice amount of square footage. Let's go ahead and head in. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. Hope you're enjoying it already. Be sure to drop a like if you will. And don't forget to subscribe and notification bell if you have not. Let's go. Now that we're out of that traffic noise, it is something else, isn't it? Yeah, let me just tell you all this. Every home they have here is set up wonderfully and staged so nice. This is one of those lots that I missed in the past. Uh, I really appreciate them letting me tour some of their homes, but this is just coming from me. It's not like they're telling me to say any of this or whatever, but this is one of those dealerships where everything is top notch. Everything is clean. Everything is nice. And to me, that means a lot for all the different places that I've been. They really care about what they're doing and all that. So, I don't know. Y'all drop a comment. Let me know what you think about the house. Is that Zach Efron? What in the world are you doing in here, boy? <laughs> Shooting a bow? You ain't no hunter. Just kidding, he may be. Don't know. I already thought of the title for this one. I ran into Zac Efron in this house. Or, I walked in and saw Zac Efron. I don't know, I'll come up with something. Y'all help me out, maybe I need to change the title. So it's a one bed, one bath, but we still have our kitchen island. You're still gonna have a lot of nice features like tile shower. You got this beautiful backsplash. It's not like it's just, you know, thrown together and it's just your cookie cutter house because it's small. Built-in microwave right there above our stove. And we've got cannons and drawers here on this side of the island. 
I think we've seen everything. I'm not trying to be too hasty, but also don't want to take up your whole day. Maybe you got another home on the playlist you'd like to watch after this one. This is where your furnace is going to be, and then we're going to have your stackable washer and dryer that would go right here. Here's that side door that does have the blinds in it. I've seen this in like all of their home. Every home that I've toured here has this in them. Let's pull it all the way up and just show you kind of the difference. And here's the bathroom. Wow, we even got the backsplash in here. Is that Graham stepping? <laughs> Yeah, I was like, man, there's celebrities all in this. I'm glad to see they put this here, these cabinets here above the commode. You need all this, you know, all the storage you can get in a house like this. The home that I just did right down there, that red one, I don't know if you got caught a glimpse of it. It has the coolest looking tile in the shower. Y'all need to watch that video if you haven't, if it's out. I don't know which one I'll put out first. I'm gonna say I'll probably put that one out first. This tile doesn't have, like that tile has like a gloss and this one's kind of more of like your flat color. Um, so it looks good for this house, kind of a little bit of a rustic vibe, maybe. We step into the bedroom. And there is the porch. So three different entryways in this one bad house. How about that? Water heater is going to be right there behind there. We don't see any wire racks. I haven't seen any all day here. All of their homes have these really nice racks that you've seen right there. So with these cottages, they have two bedrooms. They have, I showed y'all a little bit of that there up front. Um, but yeah, they have so many different versions. Check out their website if you want to. But I decided to get this one because of that porch. But just keep in mind, a lot of different options with these smart cottages. Now y'all stay tuned and we'll talk a little more about that and get you some pricing and all that good stuff. Uh, but yeah, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and please drop a like if you will. And would you share this video? I feel like maybe there's somebody out there that needs to see this home. I mean, it's got Zac Efron in it, y'all. <laughs> I appreciate that a lot. Let's do the outro here just a little bit differently. Uh, this is kind of what we do in our members area. But there was so much information that I kind of wanted to show y'all on the uh, their website. So I thought, let's just do this. Uh, this is basically we are screen recording here on my computer. And, well, this is the video I've been editing. But anyways, here's where I would like to get to. And so, as you can tell, this home right here that we toured at Oak Creek Homes in Splendor, Texas, is the Starling and there's a lot of different versions and all that i'm going to get into that in just a moment but what i wanted to show you was their website where you can find out a lot more information if you want to do that plus you can see all the different dealers they have just put in zip codes and all that and you can get that information there but what i really want to talk about is this is a smart cottage that oak creek homes builds and they have several different uh, uh links and bedroom or, or just models and like floor plans and that's what I wanted to go to. And you can find a lot of that here on their website. Now here is our floor plan. Let's look at this for just a second. You can see the Starlin. You can see you have that option for that rear deck. Uh, you see you got the front porch. You got the one bed, one bath. 
you've got your area here for your standalone uh, washer, I'm not standalone, stackable washer and dryer. Goodness gracious, Jesus. And then you got some other options right here. But if you, if what I wanted to really show you here, you can kind of go to this website as well, smartcottagehome.com, and this will kind of break down all the different floor plans. Now, you can see, actually, let me show you, like, you see how the one we toured uh, had the bay windows there? Actually, if you go back and look at some of their pictures on this house, you can see you could even option it with those uh, bay windows back there on the main bedroom. Uh, so just a lot of different things you can do when it comes to customizing these houses. But I wanted to show you the different floor plans. Let me scooch on over here. <laughs> okay. Let's see. There we go. So there's the... there. No, wait. Sorry. This is a different one. This is one I wanted to show you. See how this house is a little bit longer? And you've got your spot for your washer and dryer stuff there. Uh, and then right here is the one that we toured. And you can see it's a 16 by 48 box. That's a six, uh, 14 by 52. So we're two foot wider, but we're not quite as long. And then you come on down here, you've got a 16 by 64. Pretty much the same kind of living room, kitchen concept. Then we have different bedrooms. This is a uh, two bed, two bath, 868 square foot. You come on down here, you got a different version. The Mockingbird, I've actually toured this one before. That's a two bed, one bath, 775 square foot and then so as you can see uh they're going to have some similarities but they're all going to be a little bit different in their own way now this is your double wide versions the swan i just did there uh at it's the it's the home on the channel it's the red double wide that kind of looks the same but then you have the falcon which is a little bit smaller and so just a lot of cool things that i wanted to show you here and Y'all just keep in mind, I, I, I mean, obviously I'm just the guy touring the house, so there's more to learn. You can do some research for yourself. But I did want to provide that for you, so help you out a little bit there instead of just me be behind the camera. You know, you can kind of really see uh, this house, and they got tons of pictures and uh, all kind of cool things to check out there on their website. Let me say in the description, I'll have some information for you. Also, we're going to have our website link, uh, which will, you know, if you want to get in contact with someone about seeing financing and all that good stuff, you can check out our website link. That'll be in the description below. People are using that every week and it's really helping them out. So that is in the description below. Well, let me just tell y'all this before we get into pricing on this particular home. Um, I've got a big, big week planned this week, and then next week is an extremely big week. I'm going on a, on a major, uh, major, on a very big trip to tour some homes, and I'm telling you, it's going to be, it's going to be exciting. I almost wish it was this week, just to be honest with you, but, uh, it's next week, and so, yeah, I'll be telling you more about that, but the next video will be Thursday night. This week, 645 Central, the video is coming out Tuesday thursday and saturday and uh then that's really all i want to discuss i got some unique homes coming out this week i started this is our smaller home and the homes are just going to get bigger as the week goes on so y'all stay tuned for all that now i want to get into some pricing on this particular model i don't even know why I'm, i zoom myself in i want to be able to just show you here on their website all the pricing stuff that i always provide is just what's provided to me and uh, this is just basically on their website so keep in mind it really depends maybe what oak creek uh uh, retailer you're getting a home from it could depend on county regulations different things that you may need far as with your setup and all but this will give you a really good starting price where's it at there it is ladies and gentlemen the starting price for the starling starting at $110,896 and that is the 620 square foot version now obviously whenever you get a bigger home or you get a different version of this of these smart cottages pricing and all that changes but this will give you a great idea on this home thank you all so much for watching i hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and i really encourage you to come back thursday night because it's going to be um well let me just tell you this it's a home that uh is it's a modular home and it's something that i see y'all really enjoy looking at so y'all i think y'all really like it y'all come back and I hope to see you here. All right, so now I'm trying to figure out how to... Oh, there's the stop record button right there. So should I click it? Yeah, well, I, I guess I'm going to... Well, I guess this is the point of the show where... Oh, here it goes. One, 